A while ago, I did a video for No Need Bread. The rising time for that bread was 18 hours. I found out you can make the same bread and only let it rise between four and six hours. So I tried it out, came out great. And today I'm filming it for you. Start with three cups of all-purpose flour, two and a quarter teaspoons of instant active dry yeast, one and a half teaspoons of salt, one and a half cups of warm water. Mix this all together. Now you're gonna cover it with plastic wrap and put it in a warm room to rest for about four to six hours. This is what it's gonna look like after four hours. See how sticky it is? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take some oil, I'm using olive oil, and put it on your pan. And just get some on your hands too, because you gotta handle this dough. Get the dough out of the pot. Oh, yeah. You're gonna punch it down, they call this part. Punching it down. And then you're gonna, woo, then put it on the baking sheet. And now you're gonna flip it over once, twice, and three times. And you're gonna cover it with plastic wrap and we're gonna let this dough rest for another half hour. While your bread is rising, you're gonna get your cast iron pot with the lid, make sure that it has a lid and it has to be cast iron or whatever will withstand the type of heat. You're gonna put your oven at 450 and put the empty pot and the lid inside the oven and make it really, really hot before we get that bread in there. The pot's out of the oven, it's very hot, so be careful, just throw your bread on there. If you see that it's uneven, just shake it up. It'll even itself up. Put the lid back on and put it in the oven for 30 minutes. Then what you're gonna do is take the lid off and let it cook for an additional 15 minutes without the lid till it's nice and brown. Here it is, out of the oven, you can hear. Listen to that crust. Oh my God, look at this. Let's see how it looks. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. Ah, oh, let's try this. Still a little hot. You can see the steam coming off. So good. I love bread. And I didn't know, you wanna try it? Yeah. I didn't know that you could do it in four hours. Absolutely fabulous. You could start it in the morning, cook it in the afternoon, and have it for your guests in the evening. Isn't that great? I hope you try this. Don't forget to hit thumbs up and enjoy. For more great side dish recipes, check out my playlist. And don't forget to subscribe. I post a new video every Saturday.